My name is Rick. This is my husband, Carlos. We have two dogs, Gigi and Harley. Our older dog, Harley, is a blue-nosed pit bull. She just turned 10, and I've had her since she was six weeks old. Harley is very friendly. She loves people. She is 72-ish pounds and thinks she's a lap dog. <laughs> In January of 2020, Harley was diagnosed with lymphoma. When the neurologist first told me that it didn't really register at that moment, just thinking, like, she's only seven. I'm not ready for her to go yet. But as soon as, as, soon as she told me that, um, Harley turned around and jumped up on me and started licking my face. Basically, like, it's gonna be okay, don't worry. So we wanted to try to give her more quality of life and try to- Kind of spark up Yeah, and give her some well. energy. Yes. And so we introduced Gigi. Gigi is our pit bull. Gigi is spunky and she's fun and she has that pity smile where her smile is just as big as her face from ear to ear and she's loving. And the two of them are close now. I feel like she has brought some life back into Harley. Definitely, Harley's yes. Harley is much better now with Gigi. She used to just basically sleep all day, mm -hmm. and now she likes to play. She just wants to keep up with Gigi as well. With Harley, they said that she would have six to 12 months to live, and she's now past two years. But Gigi, oh, there's two sides to Gigi. Come on, Gigi, hey. There's the aggressive nature when we walk her or if she's in the car and she sees another dog where she tends to act violently. We don't want it to get to that level that she actually bites someone else or bites another dog. No, 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 no. I feel like she's going to attack the dog and she's going to possibly kill the dog. I know she's, she's capable of doing that because she's strong. It would be devastating if she were to do something like that to the point where if she had to be put down or something, that would just be the worst thing ever. Right now, Carlos is in school and he has a really busy schedule. So it's usually me that's taking care of the dogs and sometimes they're just too much for one person to handle. My biggest hope is that we can not have to worry about Gigi's behavior and have her be surrounded by lots of people and lots of dogs and be a little angel. That would be a dream come true. <laughs>